And residents across the state gathered in Marion County as hundreds of people received boxes of food. Our Ronell Hunt was in Fairmont and has more. In just a little over one hour, more than 150 people gathered right behind me to receive food from the first ever Mountaineer Food Bank. Soup Opera Executive Director Jennifer Smith says that this has been a growing idea for quite some time, but to see it finally put into action and helping so many people makes all the planning worth it. How it all come about is the Soup Opera, we partnered with the Mountaineer Food Bank as well as Connecting Link has come on board to help us um, just to come together and to take care of our community is how it all came about, to show that we can work together as one whole group to make things happen for your community and the people in your community. By having multiple organizations involved in feeding people, Smith says the main objective is to continue in working with organizations under one goal to alleviate the pressure that directly affects individual agencies. We're trying to help take some of the pressures off the different agencies that do give out food because we see it every day. Our numbers are rising. Last week I had 126 people, not including meals. So in one day we're doing over 150 meals we're giving out. As numbers continue to rise for people in need, the Mobile Food Pantry and Soup Opera will continue to focus on how to address the issues of the county in more ways than one. We're hoping with this being an ongoing event, it's going to take all the pressure off some of the other agencies in this county, and we can start putting our resources to where they need to be. Smith says that the Mountaineer Food Bank and the Soup Opera will continue to host events just like this one today, starting with a bi-monthly event all throughout the year. Reporting at Fairmont for 12 News, I am Ron L. Hunt. Thank <laughs> you.